Each October, just in time for the busy holiday shopping season, National Cybersecurity Awareness Month provides a timely reminder of the need for online safety. Joining us today is Head of Security Policy at Meta, Nathaniel Gleischer, with some tips on how to keep yourself and your devices safe this holiday season. Nathaniel, welcome. Thanks for having me. Cybersecurity is important. Hacks, threats, we are online now more than ever, and we need to be aware of what is happening in that space. How important is awareness? I think awareness is particularly important. People really worry about being safe online. The good news though is that there are some simple tips that people can follow to keep themselves safe and make life much harder for cyber criminals. My team so works with other teams across Meta and partners across society to build safe spaces for people to connect and build community and for businesses to reach their customers. What is a proactive step that we should take to improve online safety? Well, one simple recommendation is that everyone should turn on two-factor authentication for all of your accounts. Two-factor authentication or 2FA is one of the most effective and simplest tools for protecting your accounts online. On Facebook and Instagram, you can do this by going into your security and login settings and selecting use two-factor authentication to get started. In addition to social media, I'd also recommend that people turn two-factor authentication on, of course, for their banking accounts, but also for things like personal email. I think we don't often think of personal email as being part of our safety and security online, but uh, cyber criminals often begin by compromising personal email. So it's good to make sure we protect it. We are always taught that passwords are paramount to have a really complex password, but we're seeing that now, even with that, we are still at risk. How can we combat that and other account security measures? Well, I think one of the challenges people have is that you have a lot of passwords. You have a lot of accounts online. Maybe you're the parent of a family and you're managing all your family's accounts, or maybe you run a small business and you have a whole range of different online accounts you use to run that business. And so what do you do? You start reusing the same password. This can be a real risk because a cyber criminal, if they get access to one of your accounts, can get access to all of them. What I would recommend is that people use a password manager. This will store strong, unique passwords for all of your accounts. And the good news is all you need to do is have one good, strong password for that password manager, and then it remembers all the other passwords for you. It's a really good and simple step. It's certainly one that I use and I would recommend it to everyone. Nathaniel, how can we make online shopping safer? Online shopping, I think, is a really good topic, particularly now as we're heading into the holiday season. A couple of things. I would recommend that first people research before you buy. Review the seller's profile along with product reviews and ratings to make sure you know what you're getting. And always use secure transaction and payment methods. Don't provide gift card details to someone you don't know and avoid transactions that require you to only pay with a gift card. If you're shopping on Facebook or Instagram, you can turn on login alerts so that you'll be notified if someone tries to access your account. You can turn this on by going to facebook.com slash help and then following the instructions there. Thank you for sharing. Head of Security Policy at Meta, Nathaniel Gleischer. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me.